Well, if you've got a wonderful perennial bed like we have here, it often is nice to know what you've got, where you've got it, especially in the fall and the winter when all we've got is bare earth. We'll really know where our plants are planted so we don't damage them if we have to add something a little bit later on. Now, there's a number of different tags you can use. I've got a few of them here. This is your standard plastic tag with your little uh, metal tags on or uh, wires on there to attach it. Um, you can go to some of these uh, bigger tags, which are nice, but you know, when I put them in the ground, they often are, they take away from the, uh, the plants. I don't like that very much. Um, now here's one that's sort of neat. This is a metal one. This is actually aluminum. And what's nice about this one is that I don't have to worry about anything fading. Unfortunately, if you make a mistake on these, you got to live with the mistake for a while because it's near impossible to change what you've engraved in there. But they're very easy to work with. Now, the standard one that you see on most uh, gardens are these little ones here. Now, these are great, and they're not really that expensive, but if you wanted to do something yourself, which is quite easy, you can actually use something like this. This is just a, a little container. There used to be some butter in here, and you cut a small little notch out of it. Now, this plastic actually works very well, and then grab a, uh, a permanent marker, preferably one from the garden center because they'll give you ones that uh, won't fade. They're UV treated and you can put your little name on here. You can plant it on. We've got an allium plant so we'll stick that on. Now why I use the container is because they've got this little uh, ridge on the plastic which makes it fit very nicely into this, which is actually a golf pencil. Now these golf pencils are great. They always give them to you when you go golfing and you usually get a whole bunch of them. Now they'll just fit right in like this. We've got a mini flag and I can stick it in here. It's set and I know exactly what I've got.